The 70th annual Tony Awards began with a somber message from host James Corden reflecting on the massacre in Orlando. And also, as many predicted, the Broadway musical Hamilton was the show's big winner. CBS 2's Jill Nicolini takes us to the theater. On behalf of the whole theater community and every person in this room, our hearts go out to all of those affected by this atrocity. It's hard to celebrate, but I think it's important that we're all here. I think the Broadway community, CBS, we get the, the show has to go on and the show is being done in honor of the victims. Well, I've never been one to rush into things, but... Uh... <laughs> Then the first winner of the evening went to Jane Howdy Shell for Best Featured Actress in a Play for her role in The Humans. The musical Hamilton made history with 16 Tony nominations. And love is 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 love cannot be killed or swept aside. Creator and star of Hamilton, Lynn manuel Miranda, gave this acceptance speech in the form of an emotional sonnet after he won for Best Score. Thomas Kale also picked up Best Direction of a musical for Hamilton. This whole night is a celebration, not just of our show, but of this entire season, which has been both on Broadway and off Broadway incredibly vital. Along the way, more performances by the cast of School of Rock, Shuffle Along, She Loves Me, Fiddler on the Roof, and The Color Purple all took the stage. This is a dream come true, and it fills me with such happiness, even on such a sad day as this. Although Jessica Lang has two Oscars, this is her first Tony Award for Best Actress in a Leading Role playing a morphine-addicted mother in Long Day's Journey Into Night. We had a hideous dose of reality, and I urge you, Orlando, to be strong. Four-time Tony Award winner Frank Langella spoke out about Orlando in his acceptance speech for Best Actor in a Leading Role in the play The Father. Hamilton won a total of 11 Tony Awards, which means the producers still hold the record of the most Tonys won for a musical with the number of 12. At the Beacon Theater, Joel McElhinney, CBS2 News. There's new information on the massacre in Florida. A witness opens up about the terror and hours.